Hello again, I'm Wade and this is the Interstellar Orbiter from Earthquaker Devices. This thing is more command module for a NASA moon mission than it is guitar effect. Really, if you've got to figure out where it sits in guitar world, I'd say it's somewhere in the area of a wah or like an old school baseball's effects where you've got two filters that sweep and die out, but it's really more like the filter control section of a 70s synthesizer. You've got two filters controlled by a single LFO that sweep in opposite directions, giving you a lot of control over how this thing sounds and interacts. You can dial in just every freaking part of it. Just when you're listening to it, yes, it sounds great on its own. It's going to sound a little bit darker, a little wobbly, where you're going to dial it in and we're going to hear some ringiness. Just think about how it interacts with effects like in the clips you just heard before. So it's really going to open up a fuzz. It's really going to sound interesting, choking out like a very nasty octave kind of fuzz or a distortion. Sounds great with the delay, very dark and warm. Let's get into it. Boom. The Interstellar Orbiter is two resonant filters controlled by a single LFO. The rate controls how fast the LFO moves, direct is your dry to wet signal, and frequency is the center point of the two filters. Those controls are global. Filter A and filter B have individual controls such as intensity, resonance, and mix. The intensity adjusts how much the LFO sweeps, the resonance adjusts the resonance peak of each filter, and it goes from sort of dark to ringy, and your mix adjusts the level of each filter in the mix. You have to be careful because this really wasn't designed to be fed pedals with a lot of drive. The mix has a bit of drive itself, and it can start to clip if you push it but it sounds excellent with a fuzz or a drive right behind it. So it likes to be very early in the mix, and I try to think of it more as a controller and less as a direct, you know, guitar effect. So let's hear what it sounds like. Thank you. 